The years after 2000 were magnificent in terms of building up the quality. Now quality was not seen merely as the quality of the product but the quickness of delivery and reliability of the product. Somebody could say Amazon products are good not because the quality of the product itself was superior but the response and delivery in short time were welcomed by the customers. In 2000, the ISO 9000 series was revised which focused more on customer satisfaction. Six Sigma and Lean Manufacturing started to grow and uh, for software and IT field, the project management concepts like Agile Management and Scrum gained attraction. The quality function deployment, also synonymously known with the name House of Quality, was developed by Dr. Yoji Akao as a tool to enhance the quality in the product as per customer's requirement, keeping in information about the competitor's performance. ISO started new standards for specific industries and sectors such as for aerospace, it formed the standard AS9000. For automotive sectors, it formed the standard ISO TS16949. For environmental management, ISO 14000 and many more. In 2015, ISO 9001 standard was revised, adding the concept of risk management. Coming to this day, we have quality over everything. Quality of products, quality of the services, business, logistics, quality of the stories, quality of the transport, and overall quality of the supply chain. We have come a long way in building up what we are today in a world where we can trust to purchase from a vendor without going for a shopping choose everything online with comparison and even customize our own features according to our needs and expectations on quality before buying a product. We are still in a long journey to quality, but this mantra will never be the old. Quality was the king, quality is the king and quality will be the king.